I just want to show you that what is the life of an average mathematician or average researcher uh, in the IIT system. We come from our the IIT houses or the quarters which IIT has given us pretty nice decent living condition and from there I take my cycle I'll come and park downstairs and come up on the second floor to my office uh, and here, as you see, I'm sitting on books, research papers, doing my work, at present writing some notes which uh, I will have to uh, lecture on in IIT Hyderabad in December. Now, what I want to tell young people, those who are reading any subject, that you should always listen to your heart. It is not necessary that you should be always walk down by your peers and listen to what your peers say. Always listen to your hearts, dear uh, friends. Please understand that then only you can progress. And whatever you do in your life, if you want to do something good in anything, then please look at this thing that I have written in this corner of the board. Left hand corner and I never remove. It is called focus is the key. Without focus, you never ever achieve anything interesting because if you write if you try to do too many things you will not achieve possibly anything much in most of the things so to do something good in one field you really have to keep your focus focus is the key for those who are, are my subscribers know that we work in the area of optimization theory which uh, is uh, the math mathematics art and science of finding the best among many possibilities so here I would just like to give a small explanation. You have already learned in your calculus courses asking you to minimize the function fx where f is a function from r to r and if this is differentiable then you know that if x star you want to find a local minimizer if x star is a local minimizer then the derivative at that point assuming that f has a derivative the derivative at that point must be equal to zero and this is a very important thing to understand that this condition that you have which to which with which people actually try to uh, make optimization equivalent to this whole thing but this actually is a necessary condition so if something is a minimizer then f dash x star must be equal to zero there is f x star is a local minimizer then f dash x star would be equal to 0 it is not a sufficient condition anything which satisfies this need not be the local minimizer example is f x equal to x cube so f dash of 0 is 0 but 0 is not a local minimizer or maximizer instead of a minimizer you can put maximizer also Okay, so this is one learning. But let me tell you what is the real secret of this. When you learn mathematics, you want have to understand that it is a subject based on logic. So when you talk about logic, so you in logic we are trying to detect sentences which are consistent. So if P is a sentence and it implies the sentence Q. So Ram was sick. Hence, he could not give the examination, something like that. Or, since A is an open set, the it implies that the complement of A is a closed set, something like that. So now, this, the negation of the statement is not of Q, the opposite of the statement. If P implies Q, a statement P implies a statement Q, the negation of P implies negation of, negation of P, Q implies negation of P. That's the reverse. When it comes to negation. So if x star is a local minimizer, this is a statement it implies that f dash x is equal to zero. So if f dash x is not equal to zero, then x dash x is not a local minimizer or a local minimizer. Anything. So this is the real power of this relation. It doesn't give you a minimizer, it can tell you whether a point is a minimizer or not. So that's a very important thing that 
it can only tell you that okay, x star is if this is not equal to zero, then x star is not a minimizer. That is the real power. It's a negative statement. Then you have obviously have your second uh, second order conditions, which you know that if you have second order condition and you have the second derivative strictly greater than zero, then it implies that x star is actually a strict local minimizer. So I'm just giving you very fast these ideas. Of course, you can get into higher dimensions where instead of the derivative, you have the gradient and all those stuff, which I have not given out. Optimization is very, very uh, much applicable to many, many things. You are always trying to maximize your profit. You are always trying to minimize your loss. You are always trying to get by the cheapest good. So every time, without even knowing that you are always optimizing. So optimization is a very important subject, a subject though originally we had a lot of calculus, but now is a subject in its own right. And I will be more proud to call myself an optimizer than a mathematics uh, guy. So uh, those who have seen my other YouTube videos, this YouTube video is pretty different. Uh, I am being helped by my former student. Ajay, who has made a name for himself in Mumbai and uh, in the film world and he is actually helping me uh, do this. Um, I am Jaydeep Datta for those who are new, uh, please uh, I would like to welcome and like any other YouTuber I would like to say please subscribe my channel, press the bell button and all those kind of stuff.